All right, what is up you guys? It's Katya Volks. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Lions Pack taste test. Yes, they came out with more stuff. So and that's why we have another one of these videos. But anyways, I'm so, so excited to try these because it's another full spectrum of cookie doughs we're doing. They do have other products that I still have to try, but for now we're doing cookie doughs and they came out with some pretty cool new things that I was so excited to try. So if you haven't seen any of my videos yet, this is gosh, like part 12 or 13 of these Lion's Choice. I have a playlist down below so you guys can always check that out. And if you haven't already, go subscribe because I've got plenty of these videos to come out, I'm sure. But otherwise, we do have all other fitness fun stuff to come out for you guys. So anyways, yes, we are jumping into the Lion's Pack, Lion's Choice. They have like two names to their company. I don't know. But what they have, my gosh, I am so excited because two of them are these like infusion. All right guys, I'm just quickly interrupting because I realized my order was kind of messed up in that they had replaced one of the cookie doughs with another one that I had ordered. So just keep watching and you'll see which one that is. It'll just be like a bonus round. Things, I don't really know what that means, but it sounds pretty dope and they look really cool. And then two new cookie dough flavors. So for the new plain regular cookie dough flavors, we have fudge brownie dough, which sounds freaking amazing. S'moreo, so it's a s'mores. Oreo, obviously. <laughs> I've always loved their combination of anything like Oreo-ish because I love Oreos. And then as for the infusion ones, we've got this zebra cake, which I don't really know what to expect for it. It's like obviously some chocolate and like a vanilla. I don't know what flavor wise, you know, what's going to be in it, but I'm excited to try it. But this one, oh my gosh, animal cookie. Remember those? animal cookies. I'll put a picture of what I'm talking about, but those aren't unfortunately vegan. So now we've got a vegan version of it. So it's pink and white. So super nostalgic for me. So I'm so excited to try this one for sure. So anyways, if you have guys haven't even tried Lime's Choice stuff, do go give them a try. I'll also link their website down below and feel free to use my coupon code. Helps you save 10% and help support the channel, of course. But anyways, I'm gonna serve a little bit of each on the caps and then we are going to taste test them. Okay guys, this smells incredible. Holy crap, these two are definitely like the sweetest of smelling. So I'm super stoked to try those. But we're gonna start over here with the fudge brownie dough. So in this guy for the two servings, or I mean one serving of two tablespoons is 100 calories, 4.5 fat, 13 carbs and four protein. So that's it right there. Ooh. Mm. Mm. I literally got this like yesterday in the mail. So I was like, okay, filming this, but yeah. Mm. Oh my God. Mm. Wow. That is so rich chocolate. Definitely one where I could only eat so much. Oh my gosh, that is so good. Wow, you have like, I don't know. I feel like their past flavors, there's always this aftertaste that's similar among all of them. That's not bad, but this is just 100% tastes like brownie fudge. That is phenomenal, holy crap. If you were a chocolate person, go get this flavor. This is like so, so, so good. So we've got the s'moreo and I even got a piece of marshmallow right there and it looks like graham cracker oil everything so we could try it all together mmm oh my gosh wow oh I love that I love how they have the, the full marshmallows in there that is amazing now I think for their infusions or not infusions like these guys but the mixes with like Oreos I think my favorite has been the birthday cake but this is really, really good. I like the mix with the graham cracker. It's different. The birthday cake one was definitely my favorite because I really like that birthday cake flavor. But otherwise, this is really, really good as well. Oh my gosh. Okay, zebra cake. I don't know what to expect for this guy. I guess like vanilla and chocolate. It's even got chocolate chips in it. So let's, let's see. 
Ah, if I grab it, it's kind of melty. Mmm, mm hmm. Mmm. Yep. Oh my gosh. So, yeah, it's like a vanilla and chocolate cake. Oh my gosh. Which makes sense now thinking about it because a zebra cake would be vanilla and chocolate. So, I don't know what else I would have thought, but wow. Oh, the vanilla is so good. It straight up tastes like, like vanilla cake. I love that. I love that. Because they don't have like just a plain vanilla cookie dough. So it's kind of cool that they... I'm trying to get this darn thing out. Can't get it. But um, it's cool that they came out with the zebra. So you get a nice solid vanilla flavor. Oh my gosh. So freaking good. Now the one. Oh, I forgot. The S'morio. 110 calories, 5 fat, 14 carbs, and 4 protein. For a zebra cake, we've got 100 calories, 4 fat, 13 carb, and 4 protein. And now, we can move on to the one I'm so freaking excited for, because this smelled so good. But yes, we've got the animal cookie with the pink and everything. I'm like freaking out. This is so cool. Ah, this is awesome. Mm. Wow. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Mmm. Mm. That's freaking sweet. Definitely one, like the fudge, where it's like rich. Well, this is more chocolate rich. This is like a sweet rich, if that makes sense. Like you can only have so much until you feel like sugared out, even though it's not all like crazy sugar. Because I think they use, yeah, some stevia monk fruit powder for sweetener. So it's natural, but I don't know. It's, it's crazy sweet, but crazy good. And it reminds me exactly of those animal cookies, which is phenomenal. And this one's also 100 calories, 4 fat, 13 carb, and 4 protein. All right, guys. So the flavor that they had forgotten to add that I finally just got in the mail is this guy right here. It's a cosmic brownie crispy treat infusion. So it's got like a mix of, I guess, oops, crispy treat and brownie. So instead they had sent me the fudge brownie, which was still freaking delicious, but I'm excited to try this one. So anyways, I'll just open it up. Um, macros on this guy. 110 calories, 5 fat, 14 carb, and 4 protein. Let me just scoop a little bit of it, but... Ooh, look at that! It's got, like, sprinkles in it! Oh my gosh, so excited. Alright, so I wanted to make sure I got a piece of brownie and, like, the crispy treat side. So the cosmic brownie is the one with the sprinkles in it. So... Alright, here we... Here we go. All right. Okay. That's the crispy treat time. Mmm. Mmm. Oh mm, my gosh. Okay, so flavor-wise, super good. Only issue, I think, is because it has like real Rice Krispies, is they kind of get soggy and a little tough. So texture-wise, it almost makes it a little difficult to eat, unfortunately. But flavor profile, oh my gosh. Freaking delicious, because it has that fudge brownie mixture in it, and whew, that is just so, so good. But... Compared to the other ones, I mean, I'm a little disappointed because of the texture. Only because it's, it tastes like it has the, the real Rice Krispies in it. And those are obviously going to get soggy. But anyways, back to the video. Yeah. Holy crap. Okay, now I've got to like rank these favorite to least favorite. Like, this is going to be tough. Because I will say that the ones that I was expecting to be like my most favorite were quite the number one. And then, mm, yeah. The ones that were like least favorite, or you know what I mean? It's not what I anticipated. So I will have to say for first, it's really, I'm really digging the zebra and the fudge brownie surprisingly. Like I thought these two were gonna be like my absolute favorites, but if I were to say one over the other, gosh, probably the zebra because it has the vanilla. So I'm gonna have to put this in like first place and then this in second place. Otherwise, Oh, gosh, because of the nostalgia, I'm gonna put this in third place. Now, this one I freaking love. Don't get me wrong, and it's so hard to rate these guys, but I'm gonna have to put it fourth place just because I like their Oreo cake batter better. And this one is just nostalgia. Like I said, it just reminds me of my childhood and eating those amazing cookies if someone brought them to school because my parents would never buy them. You know what I mean? So, anyways, I hope this review was 
helpful for you guys in checking out these products. Feel free to use my coupon code again um, if you'd like. Just helps you save a bit of a money when you go shop. But otherwise, if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a nice big thumbs up. Let me know how you guys are doing down below in the comments what you guys think if you're going to go try these guys out. Otherwise, if you haven't already, do click that subscribe button. Join the family. Next video, we do have another protein powder review. So stay tuned for that. Click that notification bell so you don't miss it. Otherwise, I will see you guys then for that video. All right. Have a good one. Go get yourself some cookie dough. See ya. Thank you.